All right, so in this one, we are going to be using the new Super Saiyan Gohan from the Cell Saga fight, where obviously it is where Goku, as you see in the background there, is uh, saying, you got this Gohan, go in, beat Cell's ass. You saw our fight, you were like, well, you guys weren't trying, right? He is that, you know, confident in himself. Well, until he goes Super Saiyan 2, he's not, but like, he's confident in himself that he can do it. And this Gohan is, strangely enough, a defense type. There's a lot in this kit that's very good. You know, this guy can walk in, this guy can go neutral, 30 timer counts total, 10 timer counts each cover change. Then he gets on cover change there. Um, he can seal rush on his main ability. Like, he's got a lot of utility. He's a supporting, similar to how Pan supports. Um, he's got utility, right? But he doesn't have cover null, and his stats, you know, they're not the craziest thing in the world. Actually, he has 14 stars. Um, 246, 236, and 179's there. It's nothing crazy. He also has less cut than the new Cell, and the Cell isn't defense type. Well, this Gohan is defense type, so it's a little confusing there, but nonetheless, team wise here, it's going to be hybrids for him with him running alongside Sword of Hope Trunks and Pan, if you don't know, Sword of Hope with his recent Zenkai. Does get endurance when he's just alongside one other hybrid, so full hybrids, he's absolutely getting his endurance here. Pan will be giving all good support as well, so we do have Pan giving HP and critical. We do have this Gohan, I don't remember Zebo because he's so new. Does he have double defense, then strike attack, bear. Sir Hope is strike attack and blast defense, I do believe, then some extra um, strike attack? Something like that there. Uh, DBZ Trunks does give strike attack defense, then pure blue card damage inflicted. Uh, Drip Trunks is strike attack defense, then extra strike attack to. Uh, movie hybrid, so obviously go on and leader slicing to get that extra, and then pan as well. Then Beast does give straight attack defense and some blast defense there. Equip wise, he is obviously in a great spot because he is a hybrid, so he just has access to the best peer in the game. That's very generalized, uh, you know, tag here. Being a hybrid peer, being strike defense, pure blast, pure strike of 24% peak there because all hybrids. This one here actually are double peering him because we have enough base for it. Double defense, then pure strike there per higher same bell number, 15% peak there. Then this here giving. Strike defense, strike attack, here, recovery, and special move damage. With that being said, let us see what the new Gohan, Super Saiyan Gohan, and yes, he can run with Bardock, and that will be a video in the future, can do in PvP at 14 stars. Let's get to it. The first match, I see Ultra Kid Boo here. What is the team? Is this Ultra Kid Boo on reps? Interesting. All right, if you swap, then I'll swap. If you're not going to swap, then I'll just stay in. Oh. Wait, what? Wait, what? I'm confused, but okay. Um, Trunks, come in. I don't know why. Alright, whatever. Let's do this. We'll do this. Hopefully I get a blue card here. Okay, it's attack anyway, so I just get a free combo. So you're not going to be able to get out of this. Cool, thank you. Let's go for the strike. Um, I'm assuming you swap here, so I'll drop. Din swap there. Alright, let's just see this. Gohan's alternate color, by the way. Looks very crisp. Look at that. Oh, not bad damage there. And so we're going to purple. Good damage. Okay, we'll do this. Uh, you're just simply dead. Which is fantastic for me. And we can continue forward. Got my sub counts lowered. I really just popped that for the sub count down on my allies. Oh, that's, that's good strike damage. Okay. See his blue card here. Doesn't nullify endurance, I'm pretty sure. Eh, not bad. Really not bad at all. We'll vibe out. That was interesting. Get a card there. That size that animation, not gonna lie, it's pretty crisp. Pretty, pretty fucking crisp. Okay. Are you gonna attack here? You are, okay. You are now dead, Mr. Hit. Holy crap. It's a lot of damage from Sword of Hope. Right, well, goodbye to you. Go on, I'd love to get your windscreen if, if feasible here. At least I hope it is. Oh, you gave up. Cool, I get the windscreen. Nice. Well, good stuff. Yeah, no, not really any complaints there. Uh, it is early season. The season literally just did reset less than an hour ago at this point when I'm recording, 42 minutes ago. So just to be aware of what's going on, uh, this go on, by the way, will do better in a later game sense. I believe after, what is it? I believe it's 60 counts. I believe it's 60 counts. He gets, you know, some damage, car draw speed, all this other bullshit that he gets for his more offensive prowess um not say he gets more defense he actually has higher cut i believe prior to that 60 counts 15 percent more cut than his 60 he has 60 than 15 
I believe he has that for like 60 or 80 counts. So he's meant to bulk a little bit until that setting. But then I'm not sure if that works completely because again, the stats, but we'll see as we uh, get through these matches here, possibly to see if he can bulk through those settings. But nonetheless, good job there. Good damage. I like to see that. This with Goku Frieza. Alrighty. Gohan not ideal in this matchup, obviously. That is a mid-range green card. That is some wild play there. Something I could not anticipate. I'm just going to go for these. I just want to see what Gohan's damage can be. Disadvantage or advantage at a setting. Okay, that's not particularly good. Oh, got you out. Gonna drop and swap. He's going to go to Rosé. There you go. Appreciate that. Let's go for this. Oh, and swap. And go for this blue card. Get our rush in hand here. Once again, Gohan's main does lower what? Uh, sub counts by five. And then it does also lock rush. I'm sure it does more. Actually gives him a vanish back. I remember that now. It gives vanish back on that as well uh, for himself there. So we could get a double vanish theoretically. If we do need it. That was smart. How much does this do? It's not a high star UVB. Not at all. Not that bad. Not that bad. It's not even Zenkai buff. Okay. Get advantage back here. Destroy cards. That shows the entire hand, right? Pretty sure it does. Alright, show me some damage against UVB, Gohan! You're green, he's red. No real color situation going on here. Just want to see some raw output. Wasn't bad. Wasn't great, but wasn't bad. Let's just do this. Oh, you're dead. Oh, you're not dead. Oh. Couldn't draw a card, I thought I would. Let's float around for a second. That wasn't... Well, I didn't think he'd swap to... <laughs> I didn't think that's where he'd swap. Alright. Interesting. Do you have a rush? Rush pan? Or not? Will you rush here? Okay. Not gonna like go on dice, but rush is no point to. <clears throat> Mm -hmm. Is it a blast? It's not. Yeah, two blues. Okay, cool. And now... I feel like you'd want to run Gohan, because his support is generalized. He could do support to anybody. Like, literally anybody in the, in the entire game type thing. I feel like you want to run him with, like, some broken unit like UVB or Goku Frieza. At least, makes sense, in my head at least. But you want to run him for that setting. Because, you know, they're going supported, they're going Zenkai buffs, they're going crazy, you know, go free to fucking go. Or UVB in an early game setting, of course. Um, it'd be a very good, you know, scenario, as you could say. And I got PB, that's that's tough. How do we live or die? We heal 3% per card we take, by the way, if you see us healing there. And we're not dead from this combo. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool that we actually lived that combo. Can't lie. Nice. Good job. Hey, now all your shit's gone. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Goodbye to you. Destroy my hand. Oh. Just let him die then. No need for Gohan here. Let's sort of hope do his job. This is supporting once again. Every time he's hit, he's supporting. You see Trunks just building up over there. Getting all those buffs every time Gohan gets hit. And when he faces a blue unit like this, it's going to be a good spot for Gohan. For his allies. More than Gohan, but for his allies. So I bet your ass Trunks will fucking go nuclear mode here if he does get some hits in. You have a lot of cards, pal, I'm not going to lie. Pretty good damage. And a lot of support already faded. My point being, a go on could make you hit fucking hard, and that's a fucking example. Um, who is the guy? Sort of hope, right? Sort of hope on God Key, though. Usually, he's not getting his ultra ability, so I'm a little, a little confused on that. But yes, all right. Keep going. Have fun. Let Trunks get his gauge. No problem for me. Almost done. One more card. Then it's done. So we take that. Well, after I pop the green card at least. Do this. Side step for me, that'd be great. Cool, it's gonna hurt. Yep, hurt pretty well. 
Cool. Let's do this. Another. Wait, he had a green or blue. Doesn't matter. Sidestepping, huh? Let's just throw this out. Get the Dragon Ball off it. Oh, that worked. He was dead. Yeah. Yeah, that happens. It happens sometimes. That's what you gotta do, right? Let's do this. Into this. Cool. Thank you, Mr. Gohan. We are obviously type advantage here, so we should do very well on our output. He has a blast cover change back there with Evo. He did not care. He said, fuck it. I'm out of here already. I have minus cardinal speed, unfortunately. I think the play is just to go to sort of hope here. And not get my ultimate, but I guess rush, because we don't have a setting to not rush there. Hmm. Once again, it is early season, so factor that into when you are trying to, uh, you know, give a, a take on this unit, right? If you're not going to summon for them, they're going to watch a video on them. It's early season, right? So there's low stars, there's not great teams. Even my team's not that great. Like, I could probably build better for Gohan here. But it's a pretty good team, right? So just, just have that factored in before you have a, uh, a good or bad, you know, process of the unit. Just give it a little bit of time before you factor it all in. It's just more initial showcase. Let's see what they can do initially. If they suck initially, that's probably a bad omen for the future, but Gohan's looking pretty solid. Cell looks pretty solid. I kind of like Gohan more. Maybe it's a star thing. Maybe, because one seven, one's 14. Um, but I kind of like Gohan more from the durability I saw. Even if that was a low star Goku Frieza, it's still Goku Frieza, and he was living all of that Goku combo. And that sort of hope one strike doing that much. Again, even if it's a low star, doing that much damage in one card, it's not really a commonality. When your support, your main support unit's dead, then your new unit that does support, they don't really know the capabilities yet, can make that happen. I think that's a good uh, Gohan value, for, especially with sort of hope trunks, because this guy's defensive. We have another, you know, kind of want to be defensive unit with sort of hope. And I, I think there's some synergy there that actually could flow very nicely if you do run these two together. Last match is Fusions. And I see G4. <laughs> Alrighty, well, go on is free, so that's cool. No, 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 no. That was awkward, but alright. Should win that. Cool. Uh, we're going to dash forward, then drop combo, because, you know, damn well G4 probably comes in here. Probably. Probably wrong, is what I meant to say. Probably wrong. There he is, the Mr. Menace himself. There is no HP bench here, dear lord. That's a green. Yeah. He's sidestepping. I hear, like, a shift happening. I couldn't hear the sidestep, but I heard the shift. I don't really know what that means, but sure, why not? I just want to lower sub count there. I know the, the lock rush does exist, but in early season, that's really not going to be something you're you're caring for. Like, it's just... Do I really care to lock a rush here? No. It's not really going to have such a profound impact in my match here, right? This might not even happen where a rush could spawn in a setting of this match. At least that's my thought process. I'm going to drop here. Cool. Predicted that. Now you die, Mr. G4, as you are already worthless, and now, well, a defense type kills you. Goodbye. Okay. Tap, 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 tappy, tappy, taps. Cool. I feel like you're gonna overaggress and do something. Oh, never mind. Oh. <laughs> I was holding the rush down the entire time, but then I was like, wait, he won't do that. And then he did he did the play I didn't think he'd do. Go on, show me some tanking. Show me some, show me some, come on. That's with full ultra ability as well, nice, not bad. Ah, all right, show me more tanking, sure. I'm down. 2.3, how do we take this? No Zenkai buffs, no nothing. Don't really have great Zenkai buffers to be fair, but no Zenkai buffs, no nothing. Okay. Oh, he just went, bro did not care. So he lived two blue cards, strike, blast, and then he will live more, but I swapped out rush here. Well, now I should save the main ability, right? <laughs> cool, cool, cool. Not bad from Gohan, though, in the durability sense. He is actually being durable, which is nice. You don't, uh, you don't actually expect that to happen from a defense type, right? You like you hope for it. For sure, but you're never like, yeah, this is going to definitely happen. That was a very nice stop time for me. 
Good job, me. Kill this fucking Bozo Vegito here. And now it's all up to UVB, the king. He's definitely not the king after, well, during that play there. And uh, after X amount of counts, and we are definitely past those counts. Low card cost there, damn. Because he lowers it when he's getting hit, right? Not bad, not bad. I definitely see a setting for this Gohan that could be good in the future. Especially if he gets like a real Zenkai buffer, because his Zenkai buffers are what? Super strong set does strike and critical, and then ultimate Gohan does blast attack. So like if he got, I don't know, green kid trunks Zenkai, he does strike attack and defense. That'd be pretty nice for this Gohan. I have I have some idea for potential for this guy. Definitely don't see anything outlandishly crazy with these two units, but I think Gohan has a lot more going for him in the future than Cell does in the future, but Cell would be probably better off now, because, like, you know, he's got Zenkai buffers for his teams, he has a very good team, comparably to Gohan, because Gohan's on hybrids, and, I guess, Sun Family-esque, but, you know, Cell's on androids. Androids is very fucking good right now, especially Blastroids. But, what do I think of this new Gohan at 14 stars, Super Saiyan Gohan from the Cell Saga. I'll see you guys in the next one for Android 16 with his plats at C+, and I am going to goddamn bed.